What's going on YouTube? This is what would Josh do and this is gonna be a video on the new trials for Android. Now I'm going about this a roundabout way. One of my good one of my friends on Twitter, he uh, happened to be in a country that this was supported and he sent me his backups with Titanium Backup. So here I am just taking them and exporting them to the SD card on my NVIDIA Shield. And then after it's done exporting, what I'm going to do is open up something, like any file manager, explorer, browser, such as ES File Explorer, for example. And then I'm going to move them from the internal storage since that's where uh, Dropbox put them. And then I'm going to put them on my external storage by cutting them and then pasting them to SD card one. And then I'm going to open up Titanium back up here in a second. And I'm going to refresh my app list. And then I'm also going to type in the search bar trials. And when it comes up, I'm going to click on it and then press restore and app plus data. And for some reason, the data didn't work on my Nexus 5. I actually had to uninstall the app. And then in the Play Store, it no longer said this isn't available in your country. It said install. So then I was able to just simply install it. I thought that this was going to happen on here. All I would do is clear the app info uninstall it and then it would go okay now you can install it again since you've already installed it and i just dropped my pop filter sorry about that so i didn't have to do it in this case it just automatically let me download it earlier it said like license validation please download from google play store that's what it said on nexus 5 so anyways this is the game this is trials frontier this is what we've been waiting for as far as trials fan if you're following my gaming channel youtube.com slash wwjoshdo you know that i'm a huge trials fan i played trials hd since 2009 and then i got trials evo the day it came out been playing it ever since and then i got trials fusion the day it came out and i've been playing that ever since i am a huge trials fan so i was a little disappointed when this was available on ios first because someone that doesn't have a single Apple product, not even earphones made by Apple. It's annoying. Here I'm just going through the little uh, game mapper mode that you can do with the Nvidia Shield. And I'm making it towards A is the right arrow, so my gas. X is my brake. Left is left and right is right. So now instead of touching on the screen, I can actually use the built in controller on my Nvidia Shield without touching the screen anymore. So that's what you saw me do with the game mapper mode. But anyways, it's annoying that they made this available on iOS first. Again, I don't have a single Apple product, not even earphones made by Apple. So I was kind of out of luck and I couldn't play the game. It was very annoying. But one of my good friends on Twitter, he helped me out. Huge, huge thank you to him. If he wants me to, I'll put his name up on the screen and give him a little shout out. So he was the reason this was all possible. And here you just click on the doors. Uh, you talk to this little lady, you press on her, and then you just keep clicking like next, and eventually I'll start racing. But yeah, like I was saying earlier, I was trying to watch what's happening on the screen and talk at the same time. Uh, my mold, my processor's kind of old. <laughs> I didn't get that dual core upgrade. Anyways, uh, on my Nexus 5, I did the same exact thing. I exported it, I restored it, and then it said you your license. I'll put that up on the screen. It says your license was invalid and you need to download it from the google play store i lucked out after it said that i i had to go to the play store i clicked on the play store and it said open or uninstall so i went ahead and cleared all the data for that app i uninstalled it and lo and behold it said install instead of not available in your country and it downloaded like a little 13 megabyte file and then when i opened it it downloaded the rest of the game just like you saw at the beginning so I was expecting that to happen on the Nvidia Shield. I cleared the data, or I was gonna clear the data, but it just worked by default. So, yeah. I'm, uh, later on down the road, this will roll out to more countries. Red Links on Twitter said that it's going to be available in like two countries, Finland and India at first, and then it's gonna roll out nationwide to the rest of the world. So, being someone that hates waiting with a passion, I'm pretty freaking excited that, uh, I've got, you know, some awesome followers that, uh, you know, are in different countries that are willing to download it and send it to me. You know, it was it's a free app. 
but you can pay to like get gas and stuff you'll see that later on in the video you can pay to like earn gas and buy upgrades and stuff so but the app itself is free so it's <laughs> if it was an app that costed money i would have gladly paid for it I, I, and that's just there's no doubt about it trials is an awesome game i've like i said earlier i've been playing it since 2009 and i i would definitely pay for this app if it was a paid app but it's free as far as it lets you click install it doesn't say <laughs> you know three four five dollars but uh yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and play this game a little bit more and it looks like it's wrapping up we got a little over a minute left the controls feel okay I uh, I wouldn't say they feel just like the console because you really don't have like precision control like you can't barely hold the joystick back a little bit but that's to be expected unless they natively support the Nvidia shield if they natively support the Nvidia shield then the left and right arrows and then the like lean back and forward arrows all those will be gone and it'll you'll just use the controls on the Nvidia shield to play the game so hopefully they update to support like MOGA Pro and NVIDIA Shield. Even if they support the MOGA Pro, I would gladly hook up my MOGA Pro to my NVIDIA Shield and play this game if I had to with uh, native controller support and like precision analog control of your motorcycle. So that about wraps this video up. If you enjoyed it, please do me a huge favor and give it a thumbs up for bringing you content super early and quick like this and please follow me on twitter and instagram and yeah this is what would josh do and i'm out oh yeah here's where you're seeing like the how much things cost and i was just clicking on those stuff to see what it led to